Hey, what's up? It's your boy Tom coming at you with another YouTube video. I'm doing a video today on a few different products. I'm doing a video on biotin, something I've been taking for about, let me see, probably about a month now, maybe a little longer than a month maybe like 40 days wild billy's beard company beard growth supplement I... cremo it's a two-sided sandalwood comb you can see it's got the fine side up here and the the wide tooth down here well not very wide tooth but wider than the top so that and last a product i got today i know i said i was going to do a video on beard guys beard oil but i went to the grocery store that usually has it today and they did not have that so i grabbed this instead everyman jack hydrating beard oil with shea butter and it's sandalwood it's one of my favorite scents right there, sandalwood. So I'm excited to try this. So we will talk about the, the biotin first. Biotin is supposed to promote hair growth. Even says right on it, supports healthy hair, skin, and nails. As you can see, it says it right here. Uh, I take two a day. It's the 5,000 milligrams. I would usually, well, I, st I started off taking two a day. I would take one when I woke up and one before I went to bed. And I, I honestly, I, I, my hair, I noticed growing a little faster. I almost forgot. Check the beard out. <sighs> Can't forget that. Yeah. Look at that. <sighs> I just woke up from a nap, so it's kind of, you know. But I'm hoping to straighten some of that out with the beard oil that I'm going to try here. So back to the biotin. I started out taking the biotin 5,000 milligrams twice a day, once in the morning, once at night. And I didn't really notice any, like, any new growth, it getting any thicker. It doesn't hurt to take these things, though. You should always take a, a, a multivitamin anyway. Um, I do not take a multivitamin. I was just taking these until I was at Walmart about a week ago. And I take these now. Now, it comes with a bottle, 30 days worth. You take two of them, sort of 60 of these in a bottle. And I read the ingredients on the back, and this is sort of like a multivitamin. It has everything in it, plus a couple extra things that aren't in a multivitamin. And it has the, the biotin in here. It has 5,000 milligrams of biotin in here. So I cut out taking this twice a day, and I only take this at night. I take two of these in the morning with some orange juice, have some breakfast, and then, you know... I, I'll take one of the biotins that night just so I'm still taking the 10,000 a day. I, I try to cover all areas of growing as much and as thick of hair and beard as I can. Plus, it has a lot of healthy things in here. There's vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin D, copper, zinc, B6, niacin, thiamine, vitamin E, horsetail extract amino acids there's so it's, it's kind of like a multivitamin but i'm guessing it has a few more things that are geared towards growing your your hair that's that's the supplements i take on a daily basis um, to help promote growth of my beard so i'll save the beard oil for last this i picked up at walmart when i picked up the wild willies beard growth supplements and it is just a sandalwood comb, two-sided sandalwood comb. The Cremo made it. It was $10 for this, I believe. And 
it runs through really smooth. It doesn't snag or anything. You can see that it's, you know, a well-made comb. You know, even the mustache part has nice grooves in it. Yeah, I call that the mustache part. That's the only thing I use it for. But you can really smell it when you're working it through your hair. It smells like sandalwood, and I, I love sandalwood. Sandalwood's one of my favorite scents. So, finally, these, I think, were about $25. Um, the Biotin, I think I paid like $12 for. And the... The comb I paid like $10 for, the cream oil comb. Okay, this I picked up at my local grocery store. This is Everyman Jack Hydrating Beard Oil, the Shea Butter. And it's sandalwood. I paid $9.99 for this. Oh, cool. It is a pump bottle. I don't have one of these yet. This is my first one. You can see it has the little pump top on there to put in. It's one ounce of oil. Our blend of naturally derived oils condition and soften your beard while hydrating. Shea butter soothes sensitive skin. Essential oils of sandalwood refresh. Rub a small amount into your palms and gently work into your beard and onto skin. The last part says we strive to use as many naturally derived and plant-based ingredients as possible while still delivering exceptional performance. Okay. It has a couple things in here I can't really pronounce, but I looked it up online and it says they're just for the fragrance. They can't really bother your skin. So the main things are safflower oil. And I never heard of that until now, but it's S-A-F-F-L-O-W-E-R. Safflower oil, olive oil, linseed oil, that's kind of a new one too, argan oil, shea butter, sandalwood, linalol, L-I-N-A-L-O-L-L, -L -L. and then it has one, two, three things I can't pronounce, and then the very last thing is fragrance and perfume, so. I give this a smell now. Ooh. Okay, it does. Let's shake it up a little bit, see if it helps. It does have that sandalwood smell to it. But it also has kind of a clean smell to it as well. So let me take off my ring so it doesn't snag any of my hairs. So let me... So I'll do like three and a half pumps. So let's see how this smells now. It smells like really good. It's a little different. I don't use the wooden comb when I'm putting oils into my hair. I usually just use that in the morning before I put all my products in my hair. I use my trusty beard brand comb to kind of distribute all the oil I put in. So it doesn't leave my beard feeling shiny, really. Like. like the beard brand oil and um like the beard brand oil and the other oil I have the cream oil oil okay this this smell it has a sandalwood smell to it yes but it has something else in there that kind of smells um you can definitely smell the chemical smell to it. So that's kind of, you know, a thumbs down for me. I like all the all natural scent. The sandalwood is the most overpowering. It smells different than my brush though, and that is sandalwood. So you can't get any more of a sandalwood scent than from actual sandalwood. So that's a thumbs down. I do like the pump bottle because I don't have to fish around with taking it off or with taking the top off and then worrying about spilling it. I like that the only things, chemicals in it are, it's just a little bit of things at the end there for just, just a little bit of stuff for fragrance, which isn't a big deal at all. For the most part, you know, they even advertise as being, I like how it makes my beard feel. 
It definitely softens my beard up. Yeah. And it actually puts a little bit of hold in there, too. It's not a light oil. So I like that about it. The only thing I don't like about I'm not 100% keen on the scent. It's not a bad scent. It's like a clean sandalwood scent. The packaging and the bottling, I definitely give a thumbs up. Um, I like the pump spray. I give a thumbs up for that. Um, I still like it, but I'm not crazy about the scent. And yeah, cool. I always put my beard oils back in the box whenever I'm not using them. I don't know. I'm kind of a neat freak like that. So, but yeah, these are my reviews. Again, the beard oil was $9.99 at my local grocery store, Giant. I've also seen this, I believe, in Walmart, and you can get it online as well. I don't see. You just go online and type in Everyman Jack Beard Oil, and you'll be able to find it. The biotin, I think I paid around $12. The beard growth supplements, I paid around $25 for them. I got them at Walmart. And then the Cremo comb I got at Walmart as well. I paid around $10 for it. And I believe Target has these. And you can get these online as well. This is definitely a good comb. All in all, it was a good product day. Um, I got to some products that I've been wanting to review. Um, I got a new beard oil and a new product today. Which I said I want to get one new product every day for 30 days and review them all. I'm going to say that Everyman Jack is not paying me to do this video in any way. Um, I got this beard oil with my own money out of my pocket from my local grocery store. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, subscribe if you enjoyed. Or leave a comment below if you have any kind of videos you want to see me do. Or if you know you have any comments on this video. Thanks for stopping by. Throw that razor away and stay tuned for the next video, which I will be doing tomorrow. I don't know what I'm going to review yet. I still have a few products of my own if I don't go out and get anything new that I'll review. And I'll have that video up tomorrow. So thanks for stopping by and stay bearded. Throw that razor away. Stay classy as always.